At the beginning of the film, we see an old man, who was sitting and was breathing deeply. A man was sitting next to him who was wearing gloves on his hands, and a mask on his face, he says to that old man, please dad forgive me. I have to do all this. The old man was the dad of this man whose name was Paul, now Paul and his wife take their dad out, Paul kills him by strangling him in the jungle, and then puts him in a pit and burns him. Later, we're shown the family of Paul. At night, his wife and his son were sitting on the dining table. All were very sad. Paul picks up the plates and leaves. After that, his son also went to sleep. He was staring at a painting on the wall in his room. Then he gets up and goes to his grandfather's room. His grandfather was sitting on the bed. When he goes to him, suddenly, he begins to vomit blood. Paul's son gets scared and he wakes up suddenly. It means that he was only having a dream. Paul's mother comes to him and says, Son, get up quickly, someone has come to the house. There was also a dog with them in their house. All these go to see wearing a mask. When the door suddenly opens, Paul shoots. His wife says, Stop Paul. There was a man there. He looks at Paul and raises his hand, and says, Forgive me. I have come here by mistake. I have nothing now. Paul takes him outside, ties him with a tree, and sticks a tape on his mouth, and that man stays there all night. When it is morning, Paul goes to check that man that he is not infected. He does not have any disease. Now Paul shows him his gun and says, Look, it will not take me a minute to shoot it. It is full of bullets. Now tell me the truth, who are you? Where did you come from? He just asks the first question, that why you were peeping into my house. And why did you come? The man says I didn't know that someone might live there, because the lights were also off. Then Paul asks him the question, what were you looking for here? That man says, my wife and son are living in an empty house 50 miles from here. We have food and water, everything is over. I came here to check all this. Paul says, are they infected? That man says, no, no, they too have disease, we are all fine. Paul asks him, how long have you been living here? He says, it's been a week. First, we used to live with my brother, then after his death we've come here. The condition of the city is very bad, there are the diseases everywhere. The man says to him, look into my eyes, I am telling the truth. Every word I say is true. Paul asks his wife and son if they should help him or not. Finally, all of them decide together that they will help him. The next day Paul goes to his family after taking him in his car. Paul drives the car and makes him sit behind him. On their way, they were attacked. Paul hides under his car. When the attacker comes there, Paul shoots him with his gun and comes out and kills him. The other man who was with Paul, who was going to take his family, says, You shouldn't have killed him, Paul, maybe he is from a big gang, and maybe his friends will come here looking for him. Now, they pick up the dead body of that man, and throw it in a pit under the tree. There was another dead body there, he tells his name, the man who was going to take his family. His name was Will. Now Will takes Paul to his family. There Paul's wife tells everyone not to worry. In Will's family, his wife, son and sister were. They had come home with everyone. At night, while eating food, Paul explains to everyone, what to do and how to live here. He also tells Will that until there is no emergency, no one has to go out and everyone has to take care of them. They all go to sleep and were living happily. In the morning, Paul's son teaches Will to cut wood in the jungle. When Paul's son was sleeping at night, Will's sister comes to him. When she comes close to him, blood was coming out of her mouth. Paul's son gets scared. He got scared and stood up. And here we find out that he was just dreaming. Now he goes out where Will's sister was sitting alone. When he calls her, she got scared. Now both sit and talk. Will's sister says, you know I like cake, cookies, ice cream a lot. So Paul's son says, no, I don't like it. On which she says, you are very strange, you don't like sweets. These two sit here and talk a lot. Then the two go to sleep saying good night to each other. The next morning Paul's son tells him that dad they're too good. Paul says, remember my son, not all that you see is true. Then their dog had started barking loudly, and was going towards the forest. Paul's son was insisting on following him. But he tells his son that we should go home. He knows the way home. He will come himself. When Paul's son was sleeping at night, he suddenly wakes up. He goes out and sees Will's son sleeping alone in a room. He lifts him and carries him to his room. When he was going from his room, he hears some sounds from the main gate. He wakes up his mom and dad. He says, go and see if there is anyone outside. Now Paul and his wife go to see wearing masks. Their dog was at the door. The one who had died was also infected because of a disease. Paul's son cries a lot seeing his dog in such a state. But Paul tells his son to scold him and go. Now they also burn their dog in a pit. At night when they were sitting together, they find out that Will's family is infected. It means Will was lying, knowing this, Paul decides that Will's family will live separate from them. When night falls, Paul's son passes by and hears Will's son crying. He goes and tells his mom and dad. Paul gets up and goes to Will and starts knocking his door. 
but he doesn't open the door. His son was infected, he was also sick. He knew that as soon as he opened the door, Paul would kill him because his family was infected. Well now comes out, he says to Paul, please don't do anything to us. We will go from here. But as soon as Will comes out, he was going with his family. Paul shoots him, Will's wife was crying a lot. After that Paul kills his wife, sister and son. Paul's son was also infected. He also dies after a few days. Meaning, Paul lost his son because of Will's family. When this story, we haven't been informed from where this virus came from. Why were they getting sick? The disease is so dangerous that there is no way to escape. Due to the spread of diseases in the city, people started living in the jungle, but the poor could not even escape there. Now Paul and his wife were left. Now the question was that will they be able to live for a long time? And with this, this story ends here.